Well, happy afternoon, folks. Yeah, on a Tuesday. So, anyways, what are we going to talk about today? Well, you know what we're going to talk about. Yeah. Most of you have already watched Sarasota Tim's videos today. I can tell through the comments. Yeah. So the most, uh, so at time of filming, he had only three videos out, and they were sucking, okay? I guess the best one you could say is what we're going to talk about today is his morning one. Yeah. You know, it's, it's his devotional one now. It's called golf. Yeah. So uh, he's still trying to put on that front that he goes in, to the gym. He didn't go to the gym. He was out in front there, but he didn't go inside. He didn't go pump any weights or do anything. He's a scammer, a grifter. Oh, a con artist for sure. Because you know where Miss Tammy was? Oh, I got to go get my nails done. I'm going to get a pedicure too, Tim. Yeah, you better go get a pedicure. I tell you what. I tell you, you know, a lot of men go to those places too to get their feet done and all. I'm not going. Hey, they better speak English around me. You know what they do. They're probably talking crap about her feet. Yeah, her man feet. I'm going to go get my pedicure. Yeah, so much for being min minimalist, huh? Hey, that's just a con artist thing, too. So you know what? Whatever comes out of his mouth, you know it's just garbage. Yeah. So let's get this started before uh, anything. The beer of the day is called Founders All Day IPA. And you know what? It's true. This is a kind of a, well, you could drink it all day long. IPAs are usually pretty damn strong. This one's a Sessions IPA. It's a citrusy, crisp, and refreshing. It's out of uh, Michigan. Yeah. I guess they've been around for a while. And it's got 4.7% alcohol. Yep. It's actually pretty good. I had like three of these yesterday. Yeah, I did. I had to t test it out. Yeah. I thought it was good. Let's see. Yep, Michigan. Grand Rapids is what it says. They got some other ones on there, too. I guess they're pretty famous up there. Anyway, check it out. You can you can do it. So, don't let him fool you about this Brock thing. You know how he's been ever since he met Brock over there in Laughlin? He's been trying to, you know, meet him again, go over to his hotel room and on. Oh, Brock's left. You know, he's went to Scottsdale and everything. I think the guy's evading him. I think old Sarasota Tim contacted him. That's what I think. And Brock just says, well, you know, I know this place over there, blah, blah, blah. Well, if Sarasota Tim did his homework, but you know he doesn't do it. He can't even remember your name or nothing. So I wrote it all down. So Tiger Woods owns 50%, okay? It's called, uh, it's called, uh, God damn, it's called, uh, what's it called, uh, you kidding me, you mean I didn't write it down? Well, it's called Pop, it's called Pop something, God dang it, I got all these notes, you kidding, oh, Pop Stroke, okay, I got it here, okay, that one's only been there for two years, okay, I even watched a news report, you can go on there and everything. Anyways, it's owned 50% by Tiger Woods and 50% by Greg Bartelli. All right? They got a restaurant there. They got ice cream. It's, I'm telling you, and it's next to a mall. If you went to your malls, remember all the Goonie Golfs around there? Yeah, same thing. And you know what? And this Greg Bartelli tells you, oh, yeah, it's for family entertainment. You know, it's like going to, like, uh, great events or whatever they call that one, main events. Yeah, anybody can go there. They got it. And you know what the prices are? These are recent prices, okay? $25 for adults. $15 for kids. 
$20 for seniors and $20 for military. So, you know, Tim's got his thing set up, he says. Yeah, you know what? This is just all scam. This is for him. He's going to make money off of it. Sure. Look at This is what it is. $30, he says, goes to Pop Stroke. Bullshit. You know it's only 25 so he's going to make $5 a person off of it. And then $5 administration fee. So that'll go to Tim, too. You know that. And then he says the entry fees can be $10, which that'll be the, the main prize, you know, winnings, plus a free t-shirt, you know. So it's going to be, that'd be a $35 that you got to put up when you could go there the next day or any time and go play for $25. Or maybe if you're a senior, you get it for $20. Yeah. Go to your own leisure and everything. So, yeah, he's, he's got one of his scams going. He probably thinks he wants to be an E-P- E-P- E-N- a ESPN commentator or something. Brock ain't going to be there. Not on a Sunday. A Sunday. Oh, damn, I thought that was the Lord's Day. Huh? August 4th. I think Brock's going to have his, what, on the 3rd or something like that? Not sure, but he had to fly off. He had to go to California. So anyways, they got these these golf courses all around the country now. And I'm telling you, it's just a Goonie Golf with a restaurant now. And it's a putting green. Yeah, you don't have the windmill. You don't have the waterfall. or And, you know, Goonie Golf, that's pretty much what it is, is a putting course. Same thing. Oh, but this is a Tiger Woods design and everything. Yeah, yeah. Don't you think you'd rather take the kids to... Uh, Goonie Golf or some, You know, they got all that stuff. They don't want to get out there. Okay, so anyways, so if you're out on the course, you just have the app there. All you got to do is download, order food, and they'll bring it right out to the course to you. They'll bring your drink out there. Oh, yeah. So this is one of those things Tim's like, oh, yeah, this could be a good collaboration. I think this is going to turn into something more. No, no. He's just trying to side hustle. That's, you know, he's supposed to pay some young college kid. Oh, who knows? Yeah, it's just no good. I guarantee you, Tammy, well, she might be there. I don't know. But, uh, hey, IRS. Hey, IRS agents. You know where he'll be now, don't you? He'll be at Pop Stroke. He'll be at Pop Stroke. Let's get this right. He'll be at, uh, yeah, darn it. He'll be at uh, Pop Stroke in Sarasota on August uh, 4th. No, yeah, August 4th. That's a Sunday. I know it's your, probably a day off, but that's when you can nail Tim and Tammy. Yeah, for sure, for that loan. Yeah, I think you could. And then, uh, let me see, what else did we got here? Well, the place is open from 9 to 11 p.m. And it says it's going to start at 9. So they're going to have to have it just for so long because, you know, they're not going to keep, they're probably going to have other people out there on the course. You just got to work around them. Yeah, they're not going to just shut it down just for you, Tim. No way. They got to make their money out there. So, yeah, he's just scamming away. And then, of course, what's he do? Goes with Miss Tammy after she's got her nails and her feet done. They go to another mall again. Where's the minimalist here? And then they go to some uh, Amish uh, bakery or something like that. And then he's going to bring you some more crushing content, huh? Yeah, it just, just sucks. I tell you what. Sarasota Tim's going downhill fast, huh? Loser, loser Tim. Loser Sarasota Tim. Yeah. Trying to find another side hustle. Well, we all want to know is, hey, Tim, where you got that tr- that flagstaff at? Yeah. You sure? I'll bet you anything you got it over one of your, uh, your subscribers' place there. 
you probably had an RV hookup and everything. Since you had to get that 50 amp. Or you just don't want people to know because you know you got a bunch of haters there in Florida. Yeah. And it didn't look like Tam is too, uh, too uh, uh, in a rush to get back to the grandkids, you know? Kind of think that was just all an excuse. Put it all on Tammy, huh? That's what I think. So anyways, if anything else comes up today, might have to chime back in again, huh? So, yeah, it's just a scam. He's just another scam he's trying to do here. I, you go look it up yourself. Pop stroke. It's just like, like a goonie golf without the waterfall or the windmill, you know? Wouldn't you rather go play goonie golf? It's just, it's another putting green. It's not designed by anybody who really gives a crap about that, huh? I don't. Damn. Yeah, and he's still trying to scam you. It's going to make more money. Anyways, we'll see you guys maybe in a little bit, huh? We'll see you later. Bye.